no, it would be very hard to say that because um, all the seven sacraments tie into each other. Mm -hmm. So like you need baptism and confirmation mm -hmm. in order to be able to receive the Eucharist. Right. So those those two are at least are precursors to the Eucharist. Mm -hmm. And then also um, the Eucharist in itself would not have been established without establishing like the sacrament of holy orders, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Because when, when Christ does the Last Supper, that's uh, on Holy Thursday is when the priestly ministry, holy orders, that sacrament is instituted. Because then when he tells the the 11, or maybe you would say the, the 11 disciples at that point in time, mm -hmm. um, to do this in memory of me, mm -hmm. he asks them to be the ones who will reenact the Mass okay. over and over again and bring him um, to the present day or to the present moment with their words mm -hmm. because the the tradition was that only the the priest could be able to make the sacrifice mm -hmm. um, of the Passover and so when he does it again there mm -hmm. sort of transforming the Passover into the Holy Eucharist and into the Mass into the sacrament mm -hmm. um, he also creates the priests who would do the same thing for the Passover in the Jewish custom mm -hmm. into the Christian or Catholic custom. Mm -hmm. And so now the you, you would see, like you cannot have the Eucharist without the, the holy orders. And then also you have the 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 last the last sacrament, basically the sacrament um, upon death or for the journey, which many people will get like before a, a major surgery mm -hmm. or within the, the risk of death. The viaticum, mm -hmm. the the bread for the journeys, is, is is the translation for the word viaticum, mm -hmm. which is when people receive the sacrament in order to gain strength mm -hmm. to be able to face these last hours of death. Mm -hmm. And many people have actually said that even if they did not, um, they did not get some form of like cure for the illness that they had, mm -hmm. or maybe even after the surgery they still were in a place of ailment, they still talk about this. Um, peace that they experience mm -hmm. because of receiving um, the last sacrament. Okay. And many even family members have said that they've seen that their family members have, have died in peace mm -hmm. um, or even more transformed and mm -hmm. even able to receive um, confession, all of these. And even confession itself is something that we need in order to be able to receive the Eucharist. Mm -hmm. So you can see that all the sacraments um, in a very beautiful way are tied in with each other.